Hello everyone, this is Lindsay and this is an audio-visual tour of how do I upload more than one file or document to one discussion post. By the way, this is a special request by one of your classmates. So, here we go. We're inside um, our contingency plan discussion. And so I'm going to scroll down to the place where I actually can reply to the discussion, remembering that reply um, is how we communicate with each other. So I have some text in here is this is a test. Okay, so a little bit of information in there. Now I see down at the bottom of the screen right below my text box that hey, there's an attach button. It's got a paper clip. I can attach stuff. How cool is that? So I'm going to go ahead and click on attach. And then after I click on attach, this choose file button is going to appear. I'm going to click on choose file because I want to navigate to a file that I want to share with my classmates or with my teacher. So I'm going to click on choose file and then a folder will open up this dialog box uh, through which you're going to navigate to where you saved your file. In this case I already had this one open so Canvas remembered for me. So I'm going to go ahead and choose this very first file and sure enough here's the, M or here's the name of the file right next to the choose file box. And now I'm thinking, you know what, I'd really like to add a second file, so I'm going to go ahead and choose file again. Oh yes, I want the second file, I'm going to go ahead and choose that, Admin Pro, this is a picture. I'm going to click on Open, which selects that file, but hey, wait a second, what happened to the first one that I had? Now I'm showing the second one that I selected in Canvas, in Discussions. You can only upload one single file by using this paperclip choose file tool. However, there is a workaround. You can upload and attach and link to a number of files within the text of the discussion that you're or of the discussion post that you're going to make itself. So here I'm already in this discussion area. I've typed in this is a test. And what I'm going to do is I'm now I'm going to navigate for additional files that I'm going to include in my discussion post. So here I go. I'm going to scroll up to the top of our discussion window and on the far right hand side it says insert content into the page. It's talking about that text box I have open. I want to insert a file. So the second tab says files. I'm going to click on files. And you know what? I want to choose a new file. I know that it's nothing that's been um, added into Canvas before. I'm going to click on Upload a New File. Here's that Choose File button again. That's okay. I'm going to click on Choose File. The dialog box is going to go directly to the folder um, that I had already opened um, just because it remembers for me. So yes, I'm going to choose this first file. Click on Open. Now, what I want to make sure that I do, and I'm kind of scrolling back and forth a little bit here, is I'm going to place the insertion point in this text box to make sure that when I uh, submit my next command to Canvas, that it's going to place that file in the correct location. So I chose the place where I want the file to go. I'm going to go back to looking at where my file is. I chose the file. Now I'm going to tell Canvas to upload. Left click on Upload. And so now here we're uploading, and sure enough, there's the name of my file that I just attached. You know what? I want a second one. I'm going to go ahead and hit the Enter button. So I go down a line. I'm going to scroll back up to that Insert Content into the Page area on the far right-hand side of your window. I'm going to upload a new file. I'm going to choose a file. Here's the second one. There's that Admin Pro one. Okay, I've got my, my file chosen. Now I'm going to tell Canvas. Wait, hold on one second. Let me check for my insertion point. There it is. Scroll back up. Click on Upload. Here we go. We're uploading. The picture's uploading. Life is good. I now have a total of three files attached to this one discussion post. One through the Paperclip Choose File tool at the bottom of the post. Two more from going to the Insert tool on the far right-hand side. Let me do that one more time. I'm going to hit the Enter button. I want to enter or insert a new file. Scroll up to the top. Go to the Insert Content into the Page area. 
make sure my files tab is selected. I want to upload a new file. I'm going to left click on upload a new file. Now I'm going to click on choose file. I'm going to choose a file. Here we go. I'm going to choose a brand new one. I've chosen it. The canvas knows I've chosen it. I'm going to double check to make sure my insertion point in that text is in the correct place. Here I go back to the file insert content into the page area. I've got the file that I want. I'm going to click on upload. And sure enough, within one discussion post, I have four separate files that I can now share with my uh, classmates as soon as I click on post reply. Um, I hope this helps. If you have any questions about how to submit multiple files in a discussion board, please make sure that you contact me um, if you have any further questions. Uh, thank you so much uh, to the, your classmate for asking this question. It's definitely a good one.